Welcome to Busan, South Korea. My name is Oren. Now the first thing I want to do is turn the chopper around so you can get a good look at the neighborhood. Meanwhile, we've got a couple birds in the sky. Let me switch the camera so you can see the older buildings. Busan has a long history. This area is only 40 to 50 years old. But just over that mountain is a lot of new development. And that's where we want to go. The first place we're going to see is the famous Guangali Bridge. The development is like night and day. In fact, the other pilot should be over there and we can get a view from his camera. Let's take a look. No, it looks like he's in Choryang, which is near Busan train station. It shouldn't take him long to get to Guangali. Look out for that building. There it is, Guangali Bridge. It's a busy city, there's lots of traffic. Just up ahead are the I Park Towers. And that island just over the right is Dongbek. Oh, just a minute. Busan Sky Tours, this is Chopper 1. Oh, it's another pilot driving on the beach right now. Let's see if we can patch him through. I forgot to tell you, I didn't fuel up this morning. You have to use the reserve tank. I repeat, use the reserve tank. The main tank is empty. Reserve tank, roger that. By the way, it looks like a really nice day for a tour from down here. Have a good one. Right. No worries. We've got plenty of fuel in the reserve tank. Now, as I was saying, Dongbek Island is on the far right. We're going to go there in just a minute. But over in the distance is the Jiangsan area. Oh look, it's the other chopper coming in. We can get a bird's eye view of I Park. Great view. He's going to head over to Jiangsan. Meanwhile, let's get a closer look at Dongbek. This is where dignitaries like U.S. Treasury Secretary Tim Geithner came to talk about Asian finance in 2011. The name of that place is called Nuri Maru. Nun means world and Maru means summit. So this is where the Asian Pacific Economic Cooperation or APEC meetings are held. Let's take a quick look at Jiangsan. Jiangsan is designed as a circle and those three buildings are the latest additions. On the other side is a quiet beach named Songjong, where my wife and I go just about every year. And this is Handy Beach, famous for hosting the International Film Festival every year. And there's a name, oops, it sounds like I'm really low on fuel. I better take care of that. Meanwhile, let's see where the other chopper went. He's got a couple of cameras. He's over in Centum City right now, and that's the Busan International Film Festival, B-I-F-F. I've got to hightail it back to get fuel. But it looks like the other choppers are going a few different places. There's uh, Sajik Stadium. We had our district convention there in 2009. Oh, but I'm passing another famous place, though. It's called Oryokdo. It's a set of six islands. Isn't that beautiful? And I see Chopper 2 is looking at the Japanese cherry blossoms in bloom right now. It happens once a year, and the trees are all over the place. It looks like there's a bonus horseback ride, too. Now, I've got to land in Dongbek, but I think Chopper 2 is on its way to Taesongje. This is a stop on the Busan City tour bus. but you can see down below only on Busan Sky Tours. Thank you for riding with Busan Sky Tours. I'll have to show you the other parts of Busan next time. There's a lot more to see.